You're sitting in a quiet room, an old clock in the corner that hasn't worked in years. The hands don't move, the gears are stuck. Yet suddenly, out of nowhere, ding, dong, it chimes. It's unsettling, almost eerie. But there are real reasons why old clocks do this, even when they're broken. First, many antique clocks are mechanical, not electronic. They rely on springs, gears, and weighted mechanisms. Even if the clock isn't keeping time, parts inside may still hold residual tension. A partially wound spring or stuck gear can slip, shift, or release pressure unexpectedly, triggering a random chime. Another major cause is temperature changes. Old metal expands in heat and contracts in cold. As this happens, internal components like hammers, rods, and gears can shift just enough to strike the chime. That's why clocks often mysteriously chime at night or early morning when the house cools down. Vibration is another trigger. Walking across the floor, shutting a door, or even a heavy truck passing outside can cause tiny movements in a sensitive old clock. Even a small vibration can knock a stuck lever loose, making it chime once or twice. Dust, rust, and aging parts also play a role. Mechanical clocks often get partially jammed rather than fully broken. When the jam loosens for a moment, due to movement, temperature, or settling, the chime mechanism might briefly activate before getting stuck again. Some clocks are built with separate chime systems, meaning the timekeeping mechanism can be broken while the chime still moves occasionally. The chime train, its own gear system, may still have enough leftover energy to strike unexpectedly. And finally, because old clocks are heavy and made of wood and metal, they naturally make settling noises. These sounds can blend with or trigger parts of the chime mechanism, making the clock seem alive long after it should be silent. So when an old clock randomly chimes, it isn't supernatural. It's just a mix of mechanical tension, aging parts, vibrations, and temperature shifts quietly doing their thing.